So in today's video, we're going to be trying out King Legacy. As you guys can see, I'm already dressed up and looking very, very nice. And when I joined King Legacy and I was setting up my recording software, somebody just came in and dropped like all of these fruits on me. I don't know if they are good or bad, but we're going to be figuring out that a bit later. But yes, before I start playing this game, make sure to hit that like button and also hit that subscribe button. And hopefully your character will be looking as good as mine. So first, I think we should apply some codes to get a head start. So by applying all the codes, I have 50 gems and my friend told me that I can buy devil fruits for only one gem. But I guess we don't have to do that because we have all of these fruits which somebody dropped me. And just because this one has like an animation and looks very good, um, I'm just going to be eating this one and hopefully praying that it is the best one out of the bunch. Oh, it's magma. Magma would be very strong, I think. Yo, we got so lucky. Oh my god. And there we have our first quest. So let's just hit them with our magma fist. They're already dead. I literally one shotted them. Well, this is going to be very easy since they cannot actually hit me. Already up to level 5, 6. Oh my god, I'm up to level 6 already. And we can put the stat points into our power fruit. And this game is like very smooth. Just like blocks fruits, this game is very smooth. Like you can um dash around and jump in the air and stuff like that very easily it's so fun i'm actually loving this devil fruits oh my god it is so good easiest quest of my freaking life they can't actually hit me and i'm gonna do these quests very very easily simple as that easy quest oh we unlocked our second move the magma hound let's see how strong this one is Oh my god, I almost one-tapped them. This magma fruit is very strong for farming. Okay, we are up to level 17. I think the next quest is at level 20. Okay, magma fist, magma hound. I just can't wait till we get like the third move so we can kill them even faster. This is complete destruction. We already have 46 points. Oh my god, I'm just gonna put all of them into my power fruit. Okay, we have so many new moves now. We have the magma floor. Sheesh. And they died from that. Oh my god, I literally one tapped them. Okay, simple as that. Oh, so we're fighting a boss now. Okay, sheesh. He's coming. Magma floor. Magma meteor. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're gonna level up so fast. Wait, does he spawn back? Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Let's go. Easy. Wait, I can, I think, just literally do this move and he will die. Wait, let me see. One, two, three. Yeah, look, he just died. <laughs> Easy, <laughs> bro. Since we have over 100 points into our power fruit, we have the magma flight as well. And he's level 30. Yes, Tashi. Okay, who is this Tashi guy, man? And we got him. Easy peasy. And we got the Tashi blade. Check your inventory. You have the Tashi blade. So we actually got a sword. Okay, let's equip this and see what it is. So we have the Tashi blade. Sheesh. But I think my devil fruit is a lot more stronger. I think after level 50, we can move on into the second island. Already level 40. And he literally got two shot. Bro, this is too easy. Okay, last quest and then we're gonna go into a next island. Level 50. Okay, here we are going to the next island. Nobody can literally touch us, so we are basically safe. Bro, this magma floor move is so good. I'm already level 67, soon to be 70. This is very easy. Like, the grinding in this game is very easy compared to all the other One Piece games. Or is it because I just got a super strong devil fruit at the start of the game? Maybe, but I doubt it. There we go, level 71. Here are the lost NPCs and we are level 76. I think now we can do a different quest. Oh, there's another boss here. This is gonna be easy. And he gives so much XP. Oh my god. Okay, and he is dead. There we go. There we go. Like literally, I've just put in all my stat points into my power fruit and I don't have to worry about my health because nobody can actually hit me already up to level 92 i just need a few more levels to get to 100 there we go we are level 100 and i think we might change our devil fruit we have like 50 gems so i think we should change our devil fruit let's see what we actually get i'm gonna be focusing on the wiki and hopefully we will get something good we got the shadow fruit Let's spin like 10 fruits or something like that. Oh, we got a rare fruit. Yeah, this is not going to be probably that good. Oh, we got a common fruit. Yeah, I don't care about that. Another common. Oh my god, we got the leopard fruit. A bomb fruit? Are you serious? An uncommon love fruit. Hmm. Another common. Oh my god. 
I'm guessing that, yep, that's the spike fruit. Oh my god, we got something epic. We got something epic. We got the gas fruit. Yo, that seems a bit strong. I just want to get another Logia fruit, like the magma fruit that we already have. Because it's going to make us grind a bit more easier, you know? Because we are only level 100. Okay, we got the giraffe fruit. Another shadow fruit. Oh my god. Another common. Oh my god. Give me something good, lady. Oh my god, we got an epic fruit. We got an epic fruit. We got an epic fruit. What is this? The snow fruit. Fruit. What do you think guys? Is this fruit good? So I've read the wiki and I think this fruit is very very good. So yeah, I'm gonna be eating the snow fruit. You have eaten the snow snow fruit. Wait, can we just store all of the other fruits like collect fruit? Oh, we need a game pass for that. Wait, I have an idea. There we go. I dropped all the fruits on the ground and my hand is glitched. Oh my god. I guess she can enjoy all the fruits. Let's go back to grinding. And now that we are level 100, we are gonna go to some else and that is the island that we are going to so let's just go there and so let's just dash there to be honest it's gonna be faster than the boat there we go we are here and set spawn yes okay here is the quest level 100 defeat four commanders so what is this move snow breath oh imprison ball Wait, what? Do I even do damage to them, bro? Like, what the hell? Okay, so they can't hit me, so this is good. Okay, let me just get all four of them. One, two, three, four. Come on, boys. There we go. Let's do the imprison. The imprison ball doesn't do any damage. There we go. They all died. Oh, why did I hit the freaking captain, man? I'm so stupid. Okay, I killed them. Nice. I think for grinding, magma was a bit more better, but we only have one move, so we can't say anything, you know? There we go, guys. Now we are level 120, so we can finally focus on killing the freaking captain. We only need one more level to unlock the next move of our devil fruit. There we go. Now that we are level 126, we will have 500 points into our power fruit. And now we have the snowstorm move unlocked. Snowstorm. That's actually actually a very strong move this fruit is actually very very strong like if i level up my fruit a bit more i think i could be dealing a lot more damage than i currently am there we go now that we are level 145 we can go kill this bigger boss up here let's see how strong he actually is there we go we got something oh my god we got the stainless jaw what is this this is an accessory reduce sword damage okay we're gonna equip that oh we look even more stupid perfect there we go, we got him. Oh, damn, we got something else as well. We got the Barbaric Axe. Damn, I think this one is going to be better than our sword that we had already. Sheesh. But yes, we're going to be ending the episode here. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button. And hopefully in the next video, I'm just going to be going all out and probably maxing out in this game. So yeah, stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.